hello my friends uh, so today I'm going to show you how to uh, get rid of uh, this uh, VTX disabled error message in Android studio so uh, if I show you that uh, error message uh, that will happen when you try to uh, run your Android virtual machine so in here if you go to AVD manager so as you can see uh, I have already set up a device in these uh, virtual devices so if I'm going to run this uh, device there's a error message pops up saying uh, enable VTX in your biosecurity so now we are going to uh, enable this VTX settings uh, in my computer so stay tuned and uh, watch it carefully another thing I want to uh, say you is uh, these BIOS settings uh, may differ from uh, computer to computer or the uh, manufacturer but the uh, procedure I mean the uh, the way of doing it is almost the same so almost uh, any motherboard has uh, these settings these days even uh, I have uh, uh, I have the motherboard uh, which was built in 2014 uh, even my motherboard my motherboard has that setting so let's see how we can uh, change this setting okay now we are going to restart the computer when it's uh, restart you need to press uh, delete key I mean uh, when the computer is booting up so when you press the delete key you will uh, go to these uh, BIOS settings from there you need to click this uh, advanced mode click OK and here also go to advance and go to uh, CPU configurations and go down so there you can see uh, there is a setting called Intel virtualization technology just click it and uh, click enable and uh, then uh, in order to save press F10 click yes now your computer will restart again Okay, let's see uh, if our uh, uh, VTX is working fine in Android Studio. Okay, now the uh, computer has uh, booted up successfully. Now let's see uh, if our uh, fix works. So let's go to uh, Android Virtual Device Manager and this is the uh, device that we have set up. Now let's click uh, launch button. As you can see the virtual device is launched.
let's see how much take it will time to load okay there you are super smooth so that's it now it's working so uh, stay tuned with my channel so you can subscribe to my channel and uh, like my videos so whenever I upload a new video you will get alerted so make sure to uh, tick that uh, bell button button of the video so have a nice day